anybody have visited the, uh, the, the famous Everly Club of Chicago? Woo! <laughs> it's one of those lovely ladies here, and they're here to give you, of all things, uh, a classy puppet show. Starring none other than my favorite elephant, Princess Alice. I have um, been going to take him a few minutes to set up. Well, in the meanwhile, I'm going to read you guys a poem. Is that all right? It's a moving picture. As you know, I am the poet laureate of the city council. <laughs> now it's true. You may have heard of some of my compositions. I once wrote this great one called Ode to a Bathtub. And my personal favorite. Looks like they're tearing up Clark Street again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're pretty great. But as a, the, uh, the poet laureate of the, uh, the city council, it's my duty to keep abreast of the competition. And uh, there's this new guy, calls himself Carl Sandberg. You ever hear of anybody? We don't read a who, but I figure just uh, to, in honor of the Everly sisters, to enlarge your cultural taste. I read a little poem he recently wrote. Is that all right?
surgery. <laughs> but how am I going to pay for it? Not from me. Let's hope that stops her. She's the biggest attraction at my zoo. The world's only alcoholic, trunkless elephant. <laughs>
cry, Princess Alice. <laughs> Don't cry, Princess Alice. Do you really want a dog? Uh-huh. One that isn't dangerous or awful? I don't want to lead girls to their doom. <laughs> okay, how about this? Why don't we find you a job as alderman of the 36th Ward? <laughs> That's not dangerous, awful, or even hard. All you need to do is get votes from Lincoln Park Zoo. Can you vote Democratic? Uh-huh. Can your friends vote Democratic?